This video is going to show how to wind a toroid. This is a 130-2. It's got two windings on it. Two wires wound on this side and two wires wound on this side forming two actual windings. And we're going to see if we can duplicate this. First we start with the T130-2 toroid. What we're going to start with, I'm going to wind electrical tape just to protect it. So we tear off a piece of tape. There. Now we're ready to wind the wire on, on it. So we need some wire. And we've got some here, but how do we figure out how long the wire is? What we use is this little chart here. And if we just look up here, uh, T130 is 1.394 inches per turn. Then we use plug it into this little equation, inches per turn times how many turns you want to go around the core. And then I add five to give you some connection lead. So it ours comes out and it's 16 inches. So I cut 16 inches of red and blue colored copper wire, solid. So one way of doing it is put half of it through and do half one way and then half the other way. Four on one side and four on this side. We can make clockwise or counterclockwise. Clockwise, we want it to rotate around clockwise around the core. So if we do that, get around starting this way. I was going to try with a glove to protect my fingers from the wire. See how this works. Anyway, feed the wires through it. gives us four turns on this side. Now we're going to put four more on this side. There. Making sure that we don't have any crossed wires. So the colored wire makes it easy to spot. So inside we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight turns. So 
So now we're going to try, we're going to take the next set of wires and do the same on the opposite side. Okay, now we're going to wind the next winding. Two wires, 16 inches a piece. And we're about right in the middle. So we want to wind this one the opposite direction. So if we look at it, it looks like this one is wired counterclockwise. And you look at the toroid straight on, you can see the wires go in. But we're winding it this way. So this, the new one, we're going to wind the opposite direction. So here we have four turns. We need four more on this side. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight turns each. Each one. Is a one-to-one -one ballon. So what we're going to do is connect this up and create a one-to-four ballon on the same core. This is 18 gauge wire, a T130-2 core. We'll have to scrape the wires so we can solder them good. Trim these. Okay, now we're going to clean off the color enamel on the copper. I'm going to use this little torch. And just heat it up. I got these on here for a little heat sink. Burns it right off. Now we'll do the next set. So, then I'll take some emery cloth like this. And I'll just scrape it until it's nice and clean. I'll do the other side so we'll get them all nice and shiny here. So here's the finished product. To create the one to four, we need to tie the two blues, the two reds together on one side. And then on the back side, the blue and the red in the middle tied together. The outputs are the blue and the red. So now we're ready to tie it in 
and create a one to four ballon.